or prophecy. I pray in America in Friday night in Saturday morning. I see shooting. I pray in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. Now to a developing story, a video just released showing a Chicago police officer not on duty shooting at two men last December. CBS 2's Jim Williams spent the afternoon going through the video and Jim, those men are now suing. Erica, the officer is relieved of his police powers while COPA investigates. In that federal lawsuit, attorneys say the officer fired at two men who were unarmed and posed no danger to anyone. It happened at 1048, Monday night, December 11th, 2020. Officer Kevin Bungie was off duty. This is surveillance video from a building. It shows the officer holding his weapon, approaching a parked car. Bungie fired into the vehicle, striking a man, one of two people inside, in the hand. People nearby called 911. There was a, a shooting over here. Moments later, police body camera video released today by the Civilian Office of Police Accountability, or COPA, shows several officers arriving at a 7-Eleven in the 2800 block of West Irving Park talking to the man who was shot. You have an idea on you, sir? He appears to have a paper towel wrapped around his hand. COPA says the officer had been sitting inside his vehicle and said he heard gunshots. When he got out, he said the driver of the other vehicle pointed a gun at him. Today, attorneys for the two men, Jomner Orozco Corretto and Carlos Ramirez, filed a federal lawsuit against the officer and the Chicago Police Department. The suit disputes the officer's claim, saying the two men were unarmed and posed no risk to anyone. The suit says they had simply parked to get directions from GPS on their phone when the officer fired several times. To make matters worse, the suit says the men were arrested. Records show the officer has been on the job eight years. A police spokesman says the department does not comment on pending litigation. We're live, Jim Williams. CBS 2 News. Erica? All right, Jim, thank you.